and welcome to Alex's Theme Park World. Today I'm literally just gonna, I guess, do an end of season video. Um, talk about all my social media um, channels, accounts, um, and the progress it's made in this year. Because I've done surprisingly well um, on my accounts. Oh, my phone's going off. Um, mainly on Instagram, um, reaching over a thousand followers on Instagram, which was amazing. Um, and you can see that, 1,304 I'm at at the moment. And so this year I've gained about a thousand followers. Um, about the start of the year, I think I was about on 300-ish. Um, but this year I've just blown up. Um, my whole goal for this year, I think it was in February I started um, I posted this picture of Tidal Wave and Stealth on the 19th of February and that post like shot up in likes I think it got about 200 likes in the first 48 hours and for my account which was on about 300 followers at the time that was amazing to me um, and then as I ended up getting um, those likes, more followers came to my account um, and then I ended up getting more likes on my posts so, and then I started as soon as the 2019 season started I was like maybe I should try and get 100 likes on every post so if we look here uh, if I go to my arch no not my archive oh, I'm working on Instagram here um, I'm gonna bring up my um, all, all photos um, sort of by likes no. in the last year and I don't know how well you're going to be able to see that it's not going to focus is it um, well every single post on here is over 100 likes apart from this one I posted this one yesterday yeah I posted it yesterday it's on 91 likes at the moment so be very nice if you could head over to my Instagram Alex, Alex's underscore theme underscore park underscore world um, and give it a like, try and get to a hundred. Um, and yeah, that shot up massively. Also, the um, just want to do a quick shout out to my um, new Instagram account that I made. When did I make this? On the, I think it was, must have been, it was about a week ago now. It's so about Tuesday-ish, I think it was. Um, it's called Autistic Theme Parks. Um, because I don't know how many of you guys know, but my youngest brother, um, Matthew, is autistic. And what, I've, what, I want, what I want to do with this account is just to show everyone what it's like, what theme parks are like through an autistic family's eyes. So I'm very excited for that. So if you want to check out that account, it's autistic.themeparks. Theme parks is all one word. Um, but yeah. Also on YouTube, um, I've gained, let me pull up my YouTube channel. Here it is. Um, on YouTube, I've gained over this oh, this year. I started the year off about 55 subscribers. I've gained 175 subscribers. I'm currently on 230. I don't know if you can. It's not going to focus. I don't know why I keep showing you, but it's just easier to do that. 230 right there. And um, right now, my highest view video is 507. Um, and that was my Portland Park um, vlog from July. And that that shot up as well. I think it was mainly because. I went to school, it was a school trip, and people seen, from my school saw it. They even started playing it in class, like, they asked the teachers, as it was near the end of the year, um, teachers started, like, oh, do you want to watch something on YouTube, because we've done every, all the classwork this year, so we'll just let you do what you want in class, and Miss decided to put, I wasn't even in the class at the time, this was just what people wanted, um, they asked to put on my video, which was very surprising, um, but yeah, um, I started vlogging this year. Um, my vlogs seem to be doing really well. Um, my Chessington vlog, that which I uploaded a few weeks ago, just about to hit 100 views. Um, same with my other one, which I uploaded a month ago. My Olsen Towers mystery pin badge unboxing, that did well. Um, tell me also what you think about all of my um, unboxing videos and like merch videos, because I don't know what your opinion is on them. Should I continue doing it, or should I move more onto like sort of like information about different theme park rides and do videos sort of like I don't know expedition theme park does. Good example there. T let me know. Um, also my F telling vlog, my travel vlog, and my Portland Park vlog, which is still by far. 
it was my favourite video to film as well. Um, same with F Telling, F Telling was amazing as well. That's nearly on 200 views. Um, let me see, my YouTube views in total is 5,524, which has shot up this year. I think it was about 1,000 at the start of the year. Um, if we go on to Twitter, I start I start Twitter last year, um, and I've gained 151 followers on there. Big thanks to my friend Go with Kel. Check him out. Link in the description. He's helped me quite a lot with growing my Twitter account and my YouTube channel. To be fair, um, some of you may know him, um, and hopefully he's watching this. Hey, Kel, if you're watching this, um, but I I'm just really glad about how well my account's done this year. And it's all thanks to you guys. Um, you've helped my account grow, and I'm more than thankful for it. Um, yeah, I don't know what else there is for me to say. Just a huge, huge thank you. I've met this year, I've met so many new friends um, across the theme park community, and it, it's just nice to talk to everyone, like Theme Park United. Ella, if you're watching this, um, yeah, everything Thought Park, they're a great account. Um, let me see. Also, most of the people I've, uh, I'll link the people in the description. I need to write that down probably when I edit this. Um, but yeah, just a massive thank you. Um, also, this might be the last video I do for this season. I might around Christmas time. Um, if you like all of my old collection videos. Um, I will do a what I got for Christmas because I think I might be getting some theme park stuff for Christmas because I definitely put it on my Christmas list. So that's the end of the video. Remember to like and subscribe for more videos like this.